Okay, part six is about to begin. Um, for this section, as you can see here, I installed the eaves and the edges of the house. I'm gonna work on my tower roof and I'm gonna work on my railings. So my porch railing here and then uh, the other curved railing, that the arched railing that goes up top. So let's get to work. Okay, so the tower roof is done. I painted it as, you know, I built it because I thought it'd be pretty hard to get inside and, and paint when it's all put together. So it's just the outside, you know, we need the shingles done. But um, here we go. Now this piece here, you have to trim the bottom section off to fit in this groove here. So I will do that at a later time, but I just wanted you to see that this is all set. And now we are going to work on our railing. So I did my first coat of the railing. I'm going to sand it. I painted all of the dowels. The dowels are the round pieces. Um, I'm going to sand everything. Then I'm going to start cutting my dowels. And I'm going to start putting it all together. Okay, we are now working on our arched railings. Um, as you can see here, you have one on the bottom porch and then you have one on the top porch. The one on the top porch has two of the strip wood pieces on it. Um, I can't really tell on the bottom and the instructions aren't very clear. So I'm just gonna kinda do what I do here. So, um, these are for the arch rail, it's the square piece. The um, regular railing was kind of rounded here. So I'm gonna go ahead and paint these, let it dry for a few minutes, and then I'm gonna go ahead and start building these rails. Okay, so while I wait for my arch rail to dry, I am going to cut the bottom of my tower roof spacer. See that little line down there? I'm gonna cut that off and I'm gonna stick it right here so that way it evens out and this little dip is no longer. Okay. So if you can see here, I laid out all of the trim. Nothing is glued. I just laid it out to see where these pieces go. Um, my railings aren't even glued. I just kind of laid them there as well. This was pretty difficult to um, figure out where all these pieces went. So now I have to paint them sand them, paint them again, and then actually glue them onto the house. So um, yeah, this is where we're at so far. Woohoo! part seven coming up. 